Hello girls, it's Sarah. I realize that I never say my name in any of my videos, so a lot of people don't know my names unless you've been consistently watching my videos and watched like the first ones where I said my name and stuff like that. Um, so anyways, uh, I just wanted to show you guys my hair because I always, I always say that too. Um, but I did a braid out last night. Um, another attempt at my protective styling and it came out cute. It's not that, it's not that bad. Um, it's a little frizzy, especially like on this side, it came out a little frizzy and this side's a little flat, but, um, I did a few braids. I did like, I tried to do like some French braids up here coming forward and it just came out weird. Um, so that's why I pinned it back here. I like just braided it and then pinned it in the back. Um, but I used my, um, Carol's Daughter Hair Milk and then I used the, uh, Curls Rock Curl Amplifier and I just let my hair air dry for a little bit so it was damp but not soaking wet and I did like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, like eight braids. Um, so I, I thought it was really going to come out really flat and it was actually a lot more flat this morning than it is now. It's kind of puffed up a little bit. Um, I only used half a pump of the curls rock on each side. So one pump for my whole head. Um, so I think maybe next time if I were to do it, I would do the product for each braid just to give it a little more hold because it's gotten a lot fluffier and a lot less defined throughout the day. And I wasn't even outside. I was actually at the mall today. So, um, but I, I do like it. I think it came out nice. Um, I, I want to try it with more product to see if um, I can get better hold because I, I know tomorrow this is going to look a mess. So um, so I want to try it again. Um, the only thing is, is it just, it looks a lot like my natural hair alone. It's not like you would notice like, oh, see this braid came out really nice right here. This little wave. And then my hair is all layered. So the ends are all different lengths. So ends are kind of kind of kind of crazy looking um I had to actually like did like really big pin curls and then pin them in I'd probably next time use like a little elastic rubber bands like that I use for my daughter's hair um to secure them to get more of a braid um the braid consistency all the way down to the ends but um it came out nice and it's like it stretched the curls too so I didn't have to blow dry it and have to do anything to it and here's to the side you can see it's a little freezy on the side and there's the back can you see the back so um not bad kind of cool so that's nice to be able to to do that um I, I knew on dry hair it just wasn't gonna come out right unless I added a lot more product so and then this morning I did my um leave-in conditioner my Carol's daughter toy leave-in conditioner twee whatever it's called and um, a little bit of the foam wrap um lotion so um not too bad kind of cute I like it um the front was I, I don't know. It's hard to get the front to look right. Um, I think maybe if I left it in for a whole day, maybe that would work. I did it last night at like 6 and took them out this morning at like 9. So I think if I left them in the whole, like for a whole day, then maybe I'd get more, um, a little more definition. Um, so that's all. I just wanted to show, show you guys how it came out. See, this one looks nice, right? soft defined but then the ends are like wriggly raggedy <sighs> protective styling oh boy sheesh um so that's all girls i just wanted to show you my quick little um braid out i'll talk to you guys later bye